Hello there my fellow fans, today's news. Meghan Markle has been left frustrated by her husband's desire to return to the UK, an expert has claimed. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex relocated to Montecito in California, US, after stepping down from royal duties three years ago. They are raising their two children, Archie and Lilibet, in the US and have thrown themselves into a number of media and philanthropic projects under their brand Archwell. But a dissatisfied Harry is rumoured to be missing his old life back in Blighty and has allegedly been eyeing up a move back home and Meghan isn't happy. Mark Boardman said, Undoubtedly, Prince Harry longs for his old friendships. Meghan is frustrated that Harry wants his old life back. Meghan loves Harry, but she wants to bring out the better side in him. And she's quite clear on the roles that they should take together and they are trying to work better together on projects. People are eager to witness a transformed Harry rather than a return to his previous party and lifestyle, which could lead to undesirable media attention. Harry and Meghan no longer have a permanent address in the UK after they were evicted from their royal residence at Frogmore Cottage by King Charles earlier this year. It was previously reported. The Prince has also found himself locked in a number of battles over his family's security in the UK after they famously left the firm in a moved dubbed Megxit. Harry is rumoured to want to to want a base across the pond, and there was speculation the King was considering leasing out one of the royal residences to the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. However, Buckingham Palace has since denied the claims. It could prove an inopportune time for the move back to the UK after Meghan was tipped to be looking at a career pivot into politics. The ex-royal was recently touted as a possible candidate to replace Diane Feinstein, a California senator who passed away last month at the age of 90. A Democratic Party donor close to California Governor Gavin Newsom, who is in charge of selecting Ms. Feinstein's replacement, told the Mail on Sunday, crazier things have happened. Meghan is definitely a long shot, but in the craziness that is US politics these days, it's not an impossibility, the insider said. Sources from California's political spheres said phones lit up following Ms. Feinstein's death, with rumors Meghan could make the run to replace her. It's not the first time the former royal has made her interest in politics known either. In September 2020, an insider told Vanity Fair, one of the reasons Meghan was so keen not to give up her American citizenship was so she had the option to go into politics. I said it before, I'll say it again. Meghan Markle for president. Comment below, like and subscribe. Goodbye for now.